been determined, but the number one seed is still up in the air after Lehigh took down first place Bucknell on Wednesday. And now the third place Mountain Hawks set their sights on second place Colgate. The Raiders won big on Wednesday, but the Mountain Hawks have won six of their last eight, and the two teams will meet in the regular season finale on Saturday. Here's how the standings look with one game to go, as Boston U holds a one-game lead on the fourth and final quarterfinal hosting bid. Let's take a look at all of the highlights from Wednesday. Lehigh ran out to a 25-8 lead over first place Bucknell and never looked back. The Mountain Hawks' Justin Goldsboro extended the lead out to 18 points with 3.07 left, and Karan Ross, who had 17 points and 10 assists, hit a late jumper to make it 42-26 at the break. Austin Price chipped in with 16 points as Lehigh continued to roll in the second half. And Miles Simulton put the exclamation point on the 84-65 win with a high-flying dunk. Colgate won with similar ease at Lafayette as Luke Rowe scored 21 points and led the Raiders out to a 20-5 lead just seven minutes in. Austin Tillotson's half-court three at the buzzer sent Colgate to the locker room leading 39-32. And Damon Sherman Newsom scored 23 of his team-high 28 points in the second half to close out the 95-83 win. Boston U used a 12-4 run to take a 28-16 lead over Army in the first half. And John Papali hit a pair of threes to push the lead to 36-24 at the break. Army cut it to four points, but the Terriers used a 10-2 run to push the lead back out to 11 points. Army answered with a run of its own, and Tanner Plum cut it to 53-50 with 4.02 left. Justin Alston scored on the other end, though, and the Terriers used free throws to close out the 63-57 win. John Chope scored a game-high 25 points, leading American out to a 17-9 lead midway through the first against Navy, and the Eagles cruised to a 34-17 advantage at the break. Jesse Reed knocked down a three to push the lead out to 17 points, and American went on to win 68-49. Malcolm Miller got the crowd going early at Holy Cross with an alley-oop dunk to take a slim lead over Loyola, and Robert Champion's late three sent the Crusaders into the locker room, leading 38-32. Cam Gregory's layup and a foul for Loyola cut it to 54-53 with 3.40 remaining and Franz Rassman hit a pair of free throws to put the Greyhounds up 60-59 with 38 seconds left. The lead didn't last though as Miller drew a foul on a drive in the paint, hit a pair of free throws and propelled Holy Cross to a 63-60 win. Four games are on the PLN on Saturday and a fifth between Colgate and Lehigh will be on CBS Sports Network. For the full PLN schedule, log on to PatriotLeague.tv. For the Patriot League Network, I'm Melanie Pulowski.